I have my very absolute best Animal Kingdom shirt on. You do. <laughs> when he walked in, I was like, yes. So this whole day, this whole evening is great because one, Matt Carl's in Florida, so get ready, world. <laughs> you better hold on to your pants. Uh huh. And two, we unexpectedly came to the DVC Moonlight Magic event. And welcome to the Chip Life Repertory Dinner. My name is Michael. Woo! Thank you for joining us today. That was. We're falling <laughs> Ooh, it's very waterfally over here. It's now nighttime, and there's cool blue light beams everywhere that say moonlight magic, and I'm so excited. If you have small children who are afraid of the dark, or loud noises, or bugs, or creepy bugs, don't take them on a to be a bug. Yeah. Or dinosaurs. Yes, but that was the first time we've been on a to be a bug, at least for myself, who's, who's been on a to be a bug like at least 12 times, who has heard like crying kids the whole time to the yeah, point where screaming. one of them had to get brought out. Yeah. Ooh, I see a party over Guess here. Guess what? I was that kid my first time on there. Really? Yeah. Oh, um, were you crying? <laughs> yeah. Or did you ask to leave? Mom and Dad, we were all crying. Mom all of you guys were crying? Yeah. And we left. <laughs> I was almost that kid at 19 my first time. <laughs> Who this ride used to be sponsored by? McDonald's. <laughs> Ketchup, mustard, mayo. And it used to be, I don't know if it still is, but there's like a chemical compound. And that used to be the ketchup, mustard, and mayonnaise compound, but I'm not sure if that's still true. But I could go for some McDonald's. I know, I missed it when they used to have it in the park. It was fabulous. Hey! Hey! <laughs> so I think we're actually being smart about it. I got, I was a really professional person with our fast passes just now. Walked right on the dinosaur, walked right on the primeval world, but there's logic. We're doing this so we don't throw up from all the food we're gonna eat. No, we're supposed to go this way. I've never been on this side. I don't think I've ever been on this in the dark. Are you scared? I'm super scared. The serious thing was is that I first said it was down, but now we hear people screaming, so we gotta go see if it's up. Okay, it says five minutes standby. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Is that real? You promise? You promise? You promise? Okay, so I just made a fool of myself. <laughs> Completely confused that cast member. I don't know what she thought I said, but I asked I offered to bring her for her premium bar. And Everest is on. Five minutes walking on. This is one of those rides you just you spend all the time in the queue, which yeah. I have to enjoy. I gotta go. I think I'm scared. I always get a headache. <laughs> we could. It's 8:50. The party doesn't even start for 40 I've more minutes. I've done this three times in a row. One time. That's my. That's my. What's it called? My record. Um, we could beat it. <laughs> um. Do you want to get that right, right back in line? Yeah. Let's go see. We're back. Walk right on. Okay. This is gonna be the last week than the first time. The, um, the Yeti is even scarier at night because your eyes are already adjusted to the darkness. Yeah. So when you, you go into the cave, him. you can see him from the first second. When you ride it during the day, your eyes are blinded. When like you go from the, the light to the dark, it takes a minute for it to, to adjust. It's rough. All right, it's 9.15. This bad boy right here opens up in how many minutes? 15. And what is this the only place you can get? Novelty ice cream. So this is the plan. Matt and Ben are on their way now from Saratoga Springs. We're gonna go here for ice cream number. Then we're gonna go over there for 
No, we're gonna go over there to meet them. Oh, meet them. And? Safari. No, and hot dogs. Hot dogs. And then we're gonna walk this way back to Safari and get number... I don't know the plan. Number two. And then we're gonna go to Safari. <laughs> I got these are these two from me here. Wait, so look at me. This is the thumbnail right there. <laughs> two for me, one for you. Be careful when opening up your makeup remember bar. You want to make sure that you open it up entirely. Otherwise, you'll pull it and then you cut. Yeah, kind of. Do I see him? I think I see him. I think I see him. Hi, Matt! First off, for the safety of the animals and the comfort of those around you, we do ask that you refrain from flash photography. Full grown, they can be up to 5,500 pounds. Now they do stay in the water for most of the day to keep their bodies cool. However, during the nighttime, they'll emerge from the water and go out and feed. Now lions love the Kobe because it is high ground. Their biggest predator is by far other lions. They do like to be able to look out, see if there's other lions in the area, and protect themselves. Yeah, beautiful view. Definitely a perk of going on a nighttime safari, being able to see these lions awake. Doesn't want to look at us, being shy. <laughs> Matt, you didn't even make a comment about my shirt. Wait, Matt's here. Hi. He's here visiting just me. Just me. <laughs> but we've eaten, I've eaten three Mickey Premium bars. At one. Two. And I've had a hot dog. Hot dog. Where'd you eat? Some fancy ones? We ate at the Turf Club at Saratoga. You gotta get stuck in it now. <laughs> the Turf Club at Saratoga. What'd you eat? I had a New York strip steak, I had mashed potatoes, calamari, and they have an awesome roasted salad there that everyone should go and try. Now, Matt, stay there. He's a twig, but he, he, he eats like he's my size. <laughs> oh my god, look at their outfits. How cute they are! It's Mickey Mouse! Yep, Pluto! You've never been on this. She has no idea. Have you been on this then? I hate this ride. <laughs> We're back on Everest for the third time tonight. And now that the uh, Moonlight Magic has started, they actually let you go up the fast passes because there's so few people here. They're not even doing the standbys. They're cutting those off and letting just people go up the, the uh, fast passes. And secure all gear in the cargo bag in front of you. Matt, look right. What did you just get from Matt? Ooh, it's going. 
He made me a skirt with his bare hands. He used a machine though, so it wasn't quite with his bare hands. It's like Mickey and Minnie through the years. Little baby blue color. Yeah, that's like turquoise. -y. Super cute, like Longer. a mid, like a mid calf. Yeah. High waisted mid calf skirt. Maybe. He, I know my clothes. He made himself a. Um, well, I think his friend helped. Him. But he made a shirt for himself of like vintage Disney movie posters. He's gonna wear it to food and wine on Friday, so. You're gonna wear that on Friday? I'm gonna wear this on Friday. Ooh. So we actually didn't stay as late as I thought we would because the party yeah. goes until one, but it's quarter to 12 right now, but we did so much. I think I had two hot dogs, three Mickey premium bars. Yeah. So unhealthy, Even but gotta water. do what you gotta do. Primeval World twice. Primeval World twice. Played some of those Everest games. Three times. Expedition Everest three times. Safari. Dinosaur. Tough to be a bug. It's tough to be a bug. The the weights were really short on the Pandora rides. They weren't super yeah, into it. Yeah, but Matt, Matt and Ben weren't into it. Even those 30 minutes for Flight of Passage. I was so yeah. game. Like I'm ready to go back in there right now and go on right? it. The thing is like when people are visiting, like obviously Ben lives here, but with Matt visiting, it's like, hey, you're the one that is yeah, he's, you know, it's his vacation, so he gets yeah. to choose what we do. Yeah, I thought this was our car. But can we tell him what we're doing Friday? That we what we unexpectedly planned? Yeah. So Friday, because we're doing food and wine with Matt, and then Saturday morning we're going out to breakfast. Matt, Chelsea, Cole, Ben, Kristen. We're all going out to breakfast, maybe right? Maybe. Are you saying for food and wine? For food and wine. Yes. So a lot of people maybe food Annie? and wine. Maybe Annie. Maybe Annie. So that's Friday for food and wine. And Saturday morning, Matt booked us a breakfast at Whispering Canyon. At the Wilderness Lodge. Or Whis Whispering Canyon? Cannon. Whispering Canyon at the Wilderness Lodge for breakfast. So since we're doing that for breakfast and food and wine Friday night, uh, Sarah was like, hey, Chelsea and Cole were trying to get a... They were going to book an all-star music for like $92. So Sarah looked up. She was like, hey, you know what? We looked it up and there were some cheap um, studio DVCs. So we're like, hey, we'll get the studio. We'll all just bunk up in one of the studios because they sleep five because they've got two or some of them have three beds. I don't think all of us are going to sleep there, but... Well, it's me, Sarah, Chelsea, Cole might, Kristen might as well. Yeah. Um, but we're, we got the DVC, so we're in a studio at the boardwalk on Friday night. And they're going to treat us to food and wine. And they'll take care of our we'll food and wine. Straight off. Yeah. And maybe we might go swimming at the boardwalk Friday night. So if you're at the boardwalk this weekend, let us know. I'm so excited. We're, we're not going to be there, there long, but we're going to be there. But... Chelsea works on Friday, but she's a teacher and she might get off early. So we were thinking maybe that she, when she comes that she would swing by and get me and we would check in. Oh, that'd be nice because I can meet you. Yeah. Oh, that'd be so nice. So I think from, from here, we're just going to do our sign off from here because we're making the trek to our park. Or making the trek to our park. <laughs> making the trek through the parking lot to our car. To the car. It's been a long day. Yes. Unexpected fun. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>